I'm just so freaking excited to be here. I just need to take it in. I just... To become more successful, you don't have to change who you are. You have to become more of who you are. You don't have to change who you are. You have to become more of who you already are at your best. Now, human beings are the only animals in the entire animal kingdom that are afraid of being different. Animals understand that in order to survive, they have to be able to identify their most distinctive traits, to understand them, to apply them, to live them. In order to grow, in order to survive, animals need to have a niche. They can't blend in. They have to have a specialty. Animals are not trying to be all things to all people. Animals understand that once they're extraordinary in some way, they have a greater chance of growing and living and succeeding by identifying that and living into it. They don't try to change who they are. They become more of who they are at their best. Now, this is true of all kinds of gorgeous creatures. Now, when, uh, when animals try to blend in, it doesn't work. A guard dog is bred for very specific purposes. A guard dog understands that its job is not to be a lap dog. <laughs> they have different purposes. They have certain competitive advantages. They have certain competitive disadvantages. And if you tried to have a competitive advantage in both, it probably would not go very well. <laughs> now, I have a competitive disadvantage in my last name, <laughs> and an animal. What's my last name? Hogshead. Hogshead, yes, and it, it really is Hogshead. Uh, a Hogshead is a barrel that holds 62 gallons. It's a wooden cask that they use to send rum from the old world to the new. And, uh, but you can imagine when I was growing up, I got tortured for my last name. <laughs> I was literally beat up on the playground for my last name. And I remember coming in to my mother, Mrs. Hogshead, <laughs> and saying, Mom, why can't we just have a normal last name like Smith or Jones? And she told me something I'll never forget. She said, it's the thing about our name that makes it different that will one day make you love it. It's the thing about you that makes you different, that makes people love you and admire you and respect you and champion for you and evangelize for you and stick with you no matter what. It's those qualities that make you different. And when you uh, identify what are the qualities that make you different, that give you inner diversity, what are those qualities? The more that you can understand to identify and drill down and own and bring that forth into the world, the more likely you are to be your most successful. And if you think back to when, think back to when you were a kid, you know, when you look back at those photographs of yourself when you were a little kid, you know those, those qualities about yourself. You didn't have to learn how to be fascinating. You were more your success yourself at three than you probably are today. Because over time, you've learned how to become boring. <laughs> it's a survival mechanism. <laughs>